Welcome to another video. Today we are going to unbox another model. Um, first of all, sorry for the lack of videos or I haven't bought any new models so far. This was my first model uh, for a very long time now. And also I think, I don't know if it makes so much sense to do the, um, the monthly videos of the new airplanes or new releases of Phoenix models. So I'm not too sure about this. I didn't buy this model from a shop. I bought it from the Swiss eBay, so to speak. Uh, it's called Ricardo. Probably some of you guys from Switzerland might know this website. Okay, here we got the model. You can see Starlines, Turkish Airlines A340-300. Pretty nice model in my opinion. To be honest, I bought it because it had the uh, Starlines livery. Yeah, I don't know when this model was released to be honest. I have no idea. But the box looks pretty, pretty good condition actually, I have to say. Logo here, the Turkish Airlines, oh yeah, I think it's certified. Some uh, models are even certified, so this one is certified by Turkish Airlines. Um, let's open the box. I'm not sure where he has opened the box before. I'm trying to do this because I really don't want to um, do... To, oh, okay, there we go. I want to keep the box, so that's why I try to open it very easily and there we have the model guys yeah to be honest and not too when I see when I saw it it's now when I've seen it now first time I'm not too 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 excited about this model I don't know why but it looks pretty nice so as we can see it is quite new because it has the the antennas and everything there we go um, it looks pretty pretty nice um, I want to zoom in for you. Let's get started. Um, yeah, there is nothing too much to say about it. Starlines, Turkish Airlines, the logo, Starlines uh, font. Um, I'm also looking for possible damages of this model, but so far it looks pretty nice. Also, when I check it on the video live, um, yeah, because it was or it is secondhand, so I'm always a bit. Um, I pay attention, but it looks like yeah, this was just in a box or in some kind of uh, glass shelf. Yeah, Airbus A340 in the back, Turkish flag TCJOL or JDL. Sorry, I forgot to mention the registration. Yeah, it looks really, really nice. I'm not too sure if you can see this here, it's just a reflection. Pretty, pretty nice. Also, the engines look fabulous. Other side, um, yeah, you can see. I think I'm out of practice a bit. Oh, let's focus here. Um, star lines. After that, we can focus on the winglets, probably. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. So, um, I'm really surprised by how good the condition is, actually. I didn't expect it to be that perfect. I hoped, of course, it was uh, very good. Um, let's check the belly, so to speak. A uh, little focus here again. And I can't find any, maybe some dust here and there, maybe here. No, it's just dust, just little dust. Um, yeah, cargo, it's, re it's in really, really good condition. Uh, there you can see the engines. Uh, here you can see the registration. Okay, I think you don't want to see my fingers, so <laughs> I try to be do this best as possible. I think just some dust in here and there, but otherwise it looks amazing. I have to say, it really looks amazing. Yeah, here you can maybe see some. Yeah, I'm not too sure if this is because of the... Maybe you can write this into the comments. Can you see this like uh, mark here? Here, this one here? I'm not too sure if it's because of... Uh, if it's uh, because of the mold or if it's because um, of, my, of the previous owner. But yeah, I have to say it looks fabulous. And yeah, uh, what else can I show you? I'm not, I'm not used anymore to do these kinds of videos, to be honest. <laughs> was such a long time ago since I've last done one. 
but I'm not dead, so that's good. Let's do a quick shot from the front, um, cockpit, and of course also the engines I want to show you. There we go, engine number three is this, and engine number four I think, correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah, but it looks really, really good, and also the Starline's livery looks pretty nice on this A340, um, in my opinion. So that's also the reason why I bought it. I, for, I don't want to be mean or anything, but Turkish Airlines, it doesn't have a very special livery to me. It's all just red and white, like the Swiss one. I also taught this about the um, Swiss livery, but it looks really, really nice. Yeah, so. Yeah, I think this is it with the video. It's already seven minutes long. Wow. Um, I hope you liked it. If you have any questions, comments, or any other things, if I should continue the monthly like uh, Phoenix model releases, uh, write it in the write it into the comments, and I'll consider do doing it again. But for me, I just think yeah, it's not really worth it because you can check it out. You can have um, your own opinion. Maybe if you like, I will give my opinion to the newest releases. I hope I can get another model, um, um, the Edelweiss A340-300, I think it was. Um, this model is also really, really great. I'm happy that I have this A340-300 now. Um, it's my first A340-300, also my first one with this Starline's livery. So I'm pretty, pretty happy about this. Pretty cool. By the way, for the people who are asking, I paid for this model $30 on, online. And uh, I think it's a pretty good price, plus seven shipping, but yeah, nobody can uh, make the shipping for free. So I think it's pretty nice. Okay, guys, I hope we see us in the next video. See you soon. Peace.